This is your Diva of Events coming to you from Sister to Sister in Cedar Hill. If you guys are not here, you should be here. It is going to be an amazing race. I don't only party, I give back. And one of the ways that I'm giving back this morning is by participating in Sister Sister. So I'm looking forward to seeing you at the finish line. introduce you to Miss Sammy with New York Life. Yes. What you have going on today? Uh, what I have going today is living my best life. It's a pleasure to be out here supporting New York Life and the community to ensure that everyone is out here living their best life and making the steps that they need to, step to take in order to ensure healthy, happy living. And I know you're here for Sister Sister, but or is there anyone that's been affected by cancer that you may know of that you're representing or you're, you know, just supporting the cause? Yes, for sure. My dad is currently in remission from prostate cancer. So we're out supporting my dad and also my grandfather. He actually passed. He had lung cancer. I'm sorry to hear that. He lived a phenomenal life, and uh, it's still a matter of celebrating him. And I believe that there's going to be a cure. It's one step at a time, one day at a time. And if anyone is interested in your services, you want to tell them how they can reach you? Yes, please. Yes, they can reach me. My name is Sammy Sherrell. I can be reached at 469-297-0540. And I'd love the opportunity to sit down and chat with you. It was a pleasure meeting you. This is your diva of events coming to you from Sister Sister. And look who I met and ran into. This beautiful lady, Miss the one and only Esther Davis. How are you? I'm wonderful. How are you? Thank you so much. Thank you for stopping to talk to me for a few minutes. Can you tell the world what you've been doing? What have I been doing? doing? Oh my gosh. Uh, we she just finished. This, by thank the you. Way. We just ended the uh, the uh, W luncheon, which is a luncheon for women to just sit and talk in an elegant setting, a uh, very very intimate setting that we have. Uh, I interviewed Alice Marie Johnson, the lady that was pardoned by the Trump administration. Great great interview. She was absolutely awesome. But she's on a tour now for prison reform. Okay. So we get involved in a lot of things. People give us a lot of calls because. I've been a community affairs uh, host for over 25 years. That's awesome. That's that is awesome. Is. So being here with uh, Sylvia, with Sylvia and all of the breast cancer victims, right. it is so important. The lady just told us a little while ago something that's very, very important. She said 10 years ago when she became a surgeon, I think she said one in 12 women had African American women had cancer. Today it's down to one in seven women. Really? It's amazing. That is. We're going to have to do something about it. We have to talk about it. We have to let people know how important it is that you just simply go and get a mammogram. Exactly. And it's not invasive. It's part of your body. It's part of the human factor. But you don't want to live with cancer. Cancer has come a long way in the last 20, 25 years. But now there's something you have to do. If medical science has been in advanced, then that's something you need to do, like go to the doctor. doctor and self-check. Yes, and self-checks. Yes. Uh, don't leave that out because your breasts are an important part of your body. But more importantly, you want to stay here on earth in good health. Right. And that's diet and exercise. Exactly. And wow. I was just commending you. 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 I'm like, what? Huh? What? Look at her. What do I do? I'm like, what? What does she do? Well, I exercise, and it's not. For staying, it's for staying beautiful and staying. I want to be. I want my energy level up. I want to, my vocabulary to. I don't want to forget things. So you do that by keeping the blood flowing in your veins. <laughs> yes. yes. Basically, that's that's all that I do. And how often do you work out? 
Uh, I'm getting lazier as we go through. Uh, probably about four or five days, but I do something. Oh, that's good. Four or five days a week. Yeah, four or five days a week. I have a, a I have a killer bike. Oh, do you? It's a 1950 bike okay. with white wall tires. Oh, really? <laughs> but it's still it it it, 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 it it serves a purpose. It's uh, I ride the bike any place. I see some people here with a pair of boxing gloves, uh -huh. Uh -huh. and uh, and then join other groups. You know, but keep active. And my diet is great. I'm very, I am strict with diet. However, I had some sugar today. Okay. So there's a lady here with some sugar back out here. Uh -huh. Well, you deserve that every now. And then. I deserve that. You're right. I, and Miss Esther Davis, can you tell us if we those that where they can find you if they want to see you on TV? Uh -huh. I want you to do two things. You can go to my website, which is estherday.com. Esther, E-S-T-E-R-D-A-Y, estherday.com. Uh, we now recently got a presence on Google because I, I think some of my models did that. We had a modeling company many, many years ago. So go to estherday.com. Or I give out my telephone number okay. because I'm a talk show host in the community, which is one reason why we're so very very popular right so you can call me look me up 214-376-9000 that is a landline that is not a cell phone don't send me any pictures <laughs> okay well keep doing what you're doing Thank you.